Beardo Benjo. Hello everyone and welcome back to Resident Evil 4 in VR, or as one of my old regular customers used to say when I worked at the game store, Residential Evil. He absolutely loved the franchise, he always came in and bought every new instalment, but he always called it Residential Evil. I don't know if he actually knew that that was wrong. He was a lovely person, and no one ever corrected him because he wasn't doing anyone any harm, you know? The stuff I used to hear working in a game store, you'd hear the weirdest stuff. I remember once um, a chap came in and <laughs> said to a colleague of mine that Bloodborne is just a medieval version of Gears of War. Just sit and digest that for a moment. Hello, Ashley. It's nice to see you again. Yeah, Bloodborne, medieval Gears of War. Now... Let's get cracking with this chapter. Now, I'm going to backtrack um, just at the beginning here because I know you can get a free uh, magnum. You can get a free broken butterfly if you take Ashley back to a certain point before proceeding into chapter four. Now, I do have to say a big thank you to Gamertag VR and to Steve Knows as well because both of them. Oh no. Whoa! Hold on, hold on, hold on. Are you all dead? Thank you very much. Um, both Gamertag VR and Steve Nose offered to give me uh, a new save file for this game. Some of you might know that I actually already tried to record this chapter and my Quest 2 crapped out on me and didn't capture about 40 minutes to half an hour of the gameplay. Um, I got halfway through the chapter before realising, so... And it was a nightmare, and I haven't been making checkpoint saves. Now, what I have actually done is I just speed ran the game today to get back to the same point, so... I didn't use one of their save files in the end, but thank you to those guys for offering them, because it's very, very kind. I've just realised I've still got the seating mode on. I need to change that. No, no. Oh, no! Oh, good God! Yeah, this is, um... <laughs> if you're curious, this is what it looks like when you play seated. It puts a little thing here in front of you on a kind of a... on a circle. It's actually really well optimised for seated play. Um, and I've been being very lazy today because I had to speed run it, so... Playing on the sofa. Let's get rid of this, shall we? Okay, so at the end of chapter... 3... Well, the very, very beginning of chapter 4, when you re reunite with Ashley, you can bring her here, throw her up through there, and you'll get yourself a free broken butterfly. Yeah! I won't use it, <laughs> because I never do. I always get the magnum and the magnum bullets, and I just keep them until the end of the game, in case something, you know, in case I need them. And I never need them. Uh, just the way it is, but... Oh, I've got inventory full. Hey, there we go. Thank you very much. You come in handy much more than I remember you coming in handy. You've actually been pretty cool. As much as I do still fundamentally hate you. Um, can I go that way? Where's that going to go? I think it's... No, we don't want to go that way. Bloody hell. Right, go all the way back the way we came. That's like stupid dog garden. I'm not going back there. My new favourite thing whilst going around the world is just throwing my gun and catching it again. It's a nice little game I play to keep myself entertained <laughs> in between fights and cool bits. <laughs> I just do weird things to amuse myself. And I forget that you can do this kind of stuff. And it is actually <laughs> quite therapeutic. Hoi! <laughs> Whee! I wonder if you can do it with the bigger guns. Oh, you can. Oh, yeah. Ah, damn it, I dropped it. This is the door for chapter four. In we go. Oh, lovely new areas and a whole new kind of set of lighting. Look at this. Look at this lovely lava filled place. Right. You. Wait, stay here. I'm going to go over there and fight some horrible people. I don't need you to come with me because you'll probably die. 
And you won't like it over there. There's nothing fun over there. All right, off we go. Wait here. You wait there. <laughs> Bye. I'll see you in a bit. Don't die, please. Hey. Okay, so this is the dragon room. Big horrible dragons that breathe fire all over my face. But I've learned that the rifle in this game is basically a one-hit kill, like a one-shot kill for everything. Do I have any ammo for it? If I don't, that's not good. Uh, no ammo. Brilliant. That's, yeah, brilliant. Okay. Well, we'll take the shotgun then. Hopefully, oh, my pistol will be able to kill these guys that pop out. No, no. Easy. <laughs> Just absolutely ridiculous. I don't know why they... That's cool. I've not noticed that before. Hold up. Ah. I've not noticed that before. It kind of intentionally pushes the gun up when it collides with a uh, with a surface like that. That's um interesting little detail. Hey! Now, I've noticed uh, two things which I'll point out to you. Those guys there look exactly like Kratos from God of War. They've even got like the red war paint, but it's not the same design. Look at him. Kratos. Hey. Hello, mate. Not so God of Warish now, are you? Oh, that's going to be worth a pretty penny. Oh, more dragons. That's fine. I know how to kill these guys now. Ah, don't burn me. Turn that way. No! Oh, God! It figured it out. There we go. These environments in this section are some of the nicest in the game. It's one of the things I've always loved about Resident Evil in general as a franchise. Like, it's so varied. Like, in Whoa, ah. His clothes fell off when I blew his head off. Wait. He had a cloak on and then... Hold up. <laughs> Does shooting their head off make them go a bit naked? It definitely looked that way. It looked like he had way more clothes on before his head came off. Ah, yes. A lion ornament. Um, Yeah, one of my favourite things. I mean, look at this. It's so different from the rest of the game. Like, wildly different. It's just awesome. But that's one of the best things about Resident Evil as a franchise. Like, you start a game maybe in uh, the streets of a normal looking town, and then you're in a, a swamp, and then you're in a lab, and then you're in a volcano, and then you're in uh, a jungle. Like, it, you, you move around so much, and the environments are so varied. It just, yeah, it, it never gets stale. It doesn't feel stale, or it doesn't to me anyway, it doesn't for me. Come on, not gonna kill you. That'd be really counterintuitive, wouldn't it, if I just shot you dead? You're the entire reason I'm here. Look at them on their little tunnel of love roller coaster. What what went on down there, eh? You little love birds. <laughs> I also found out that she's uh, twenty. Apparently, um, I've been on the the wiki for um, Resi quite a lot recently because of getting images for thumbnails and things. Um, and apparently she's 20. I thought she was a lot a lot younger. Look! Look at those reflections. They look awesome. I don't think I've seen reflections like that in any quest game. I wonder how close we're getting to reaching like the, the full potential of the quest. I am curious. Or quest 2, sorry. I am really curious to find out because... I, um, I don't know. I, is this kind of it? Is this like the best we're going to get? Or is there still some power to be squeezed out of this chipset? I have seen people playing this, Resi 4, on Original Quest. 
I haven't tried it. I don't have a quest to try it on, but apparently people have sideloaded it, and apparently it, it does work. So, you know, check it. Check out Reddit and have a little look on there if you haven't already. Um, if you've got an original quest... Oh my god, I've got no space for anything. If you've got an original quest and you want to play this game, you might not be shit out of luck. Hoi! You can tell I've done this bit of the chapter before, can't you? Just running around getting all the gems. Look at all that! Stay... Oh. Oh. Whoever's polishing these floors needs a raise. They're doing a fantastic job. But only in this area of the castle. None of the rest of it looks shiny like that at all. Ridiculous, really. I thought he was stroking a cat for a minute, like a Bond villain. He's definitely not. He's stroking a... It's like a burrito. He's got a burrito there or something, isn't he? A little burrito on a blanket. He's open. <laughs> That's what it came wrapped in. He's opened it up and it's like a Subway. He's opened his Subway packet and he's got his... Probably like a BLT, meatball marinara maybe, in there. And he's like, oh, I can't wait to eat this. I love these. They're my favourite. And he's got like a pot of soup. So I'd rather be that guy. Oh, that looks so nice. Look at that as well. Like these kind of fabric effects are lovely. I think the only thing that would make this even better is if the chandeliers were like gently swaying maybe from the wind as well. But I guess they are quite heavy. Um, from a consumer... Ugh! point of view. That kind of stuff, to, for me, is a big deal. Like, that that makes this world feel far more immersive and, like, far more, um... It's blowing her skirt as well! And her hair! Look at that! It's so good! I know it's a simple, it's a simple thing. I couldn't program it. I've got no knowledge of how to program that. But for me, like that kind of stuff, that's what immerses you in a world, especially a VR world. It's so important to get that kind of stuff in there if you can. Right, king and queen. We need to go and find some chalices to place into their hands, their royal hands. I know just where to find them. Now, this isn't actually the save file I've been playing um, since the start of... Whoa, that looks amazing. He's clearly going to get me. He's, he's shivering a little bit. Come on. Uh <laughs> and you, you're next. You're all fine. You're all right. Yeah, you're fine, mate. You're not going to try and hurt me. That one there, though. Look at him. Ready to chop my, my, my noggin off. Oh, no. Dead. Yeah, this isn't the save file I've been playing since the start of this playthrough. This is the speedrun one. I got myself back to this point in three hours Wait. as opposed to the six it took me originally. Um, so th you, that shows kind of how quickly this game can be done if you're confident and you know where to go. Bugger. Right, what have I got on me? It's only two bullets in that though. Shotgun. I need shotgun for this. Oh, okay. Yeah, all right. This bit is awesome. Here come my uh, <laughs> friends. Oh, I love it. Horrible Las Plagas suits of armor that want me dead. <laughs> Whoa! Right now, check this out. Um, pop their heads off. Get one of these. Pop it in there. Take that out. See you later, guys. Dead. That is the cleanest way to deal with those. Are we done? No, nope, there's more. Big, big ones. Bigger ones. Angrier ones. Uh, one. Two. Ooh. What in the flipping hell? No, not having that. Not having that, guys. Eat that! Stuff you all! When you realise that the flash grenades kill the, like, Plagas in, in one, certain encounters just become really... easy. But fun! Fun none the, nonetheless. Ah, oh, lovely jovely. 
Hello, thanks for waiting. Follow me. You're so patient. I just had to kill some big suits of armor with wiggly, wiggly worms inside them. It was great. You would have loved it, actually. It's a shame you couldn't be there. Classic Resident Evil puzzle solving now. Ugh. Because, as I've said a million times, nothing in these games opens with a handle. You know, the <laughs> designers, the architects in this world, <laughs> all doors have to be fashioned with pressure sensitive plates or a crank or a, a strange model of a lion that you put into a embossed groove in the wall. Just nonsense. Absolute nonsense. And I love it. And I, I wouldn't have it any other way. Right. Uh, that's the way you're supposed to go. So this is the way we will go. I think. No, can't go that way. Locked. Follow me. Follow me into the room of pictures. I think you've lived long enough. Shut up, you troll. Let's see if you can survive this time. Obviously, I will be able to. I've played this recently. I know what's coming. I started doing this as well. I started resting my hand on my other hand because you can't hold the gun, the handguns with with two hands. But just for stability, like I've just started popping it there. Feels cool as well, and it it, it kind of looks cool. Kind of looks like I'm holding it <laughs> with two hands. Kind of looks like I'm a real cop. You know? You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Me and you are like we're like this. I can't do crossed fingers in this game, but we're like we're tight. Don't trap my friend Ashley in that corridor. And then chase her down with a giant spinning wheel of death. Because I'll shoot you. That's what will happen. Oh. There we go. There we go. See, Ashley? It was always going to be fine. Come. Quickly, because that is still quickly. Still coming. God, gotcha. no sense of urgency. Ugh. Ooh. That is a lovely chest set. Only got two pieces on it, but I imagine the rest are kept like inside, maybe? Underneath there? I'm sure the merchant will still buy it for a high price. Me and him are best mates as well. What a mess. Absolute mess. I'm not fussed. They're just making a mess of their own castle. It's not, it's not me that's got to clean this up. I'm getting a lift home afterwards. Get the girl, get a lift home. Back to America. Have a good time. Party capital of the world. I know this next room is filled with dudes, so I'm going in, prepared. Look at that as well! You can spin the thing around. There's so many little details in this I'm only just picking up on. Look at that! That is wicked! Love it. Hi, guys. Hoi! <laughs> it's just, you know, there's a few different ways you can deal with people, and that's how I like to deal with people. With a swift grenade! Oh, bugger. Nope. 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 I said no. Nope. Do you not listen to me? Oh. Leave her alone. Don't. Why are you still alive, mate? Oh. Stay back. He's still going. Fall out the window, please. He's still alive. Are you serious? I did my cool guitar, a guitar. Did my cool pistol whip, and uh, you still weren't dead. Why was I thinking about guitars then? That's a strange little insight into how my brain works. There's always other things in there. Righty, getting back to, getting very close to uh, where the quest decided to just die on me before. So that's fun. Ah. Oh. That's just what you like to see, isn't it? A giant, bulging, pulsing mass hanging from the ceiling with loads of, like, little... don't know what they even are. Bits on it. Pussy... spots. Alright, let's get out of there. Let's go this way, because... Bugger! I need that. I want the red ones. The red ones are important to me. Um, God, look at this inventory. This is getting a bit mad. My biggest inventory problem right now is I've got tons of uh, TMP SMG bullets, but on this save file I haven't bought the SMG. I think I should, um, because it's really good for clearing out the enemies we're about to meet. Um, but yeah, I haven't haven't purchased it yet. Oh yeah, that's a long way for her to fall. Yeah. Christ! You're right. That was yeah, big 
Big drop. Big drop down. <laughs> it does it does look like a turd, doesn't it? Big dangly turd with bits of uh, sweet corn. A sweet corn filled turd. It's fine. I take on all sorts of monsters. I don't mind what they look like. <laughs> Leon help. What do you want me to do? There's not much I can do about it. I'm gonna help myself though. Because I hate these bugs. No, nope, down the hole. No, down the hole. Down. Bugger. Kick! You dead? Yep. Whoa! Whoa! Stay down. You dead? Nope. Brilliant. Nope! What is wrong with you? Shotgun shells it take to put you down. Far more than it should. But I can see you there. Get off. Immediately dead. Oh! I've got to throw something away to get those rifle bullets, surely. Come on, down you come. Oh! Blimey, that's a long way to go. Okay. Take that, you dick. Oh, he's running. Okay. Hello. It says incoming call from Huntington, but we know at this point it's not. If you can see me, Mr. Kennedy. Yeah, you're on my screen right there. If you even scratch her, I'll break your bones. First, we shall see if you can make it this far. I'm obviously going to make it that far, mate. I'm Leon Kennedy. Nothing's stopping me. Shit. Oh. Right, we got catapults up there. They're going to try and blow me up as soon as I run across the bridge. So I'm just going to sprint. Are you star? Wouldn't fight a all. Don't do it, don't do it, don't do it, don't do it, don't do it. Don't, no, or you. They're not doing it, it's good. They're doing it. Ah! Oh, hello. Right, he's got clothes on. Let's try and get rid of his head and see if his clothes disappear. Right, he's still got clothes. Still got clothes. I think it's just that cloak because it's attached to his head. But it looks really weird. Right, come on, turn around. Turn around, turn around. Oh. Mate, your head needs to come off. I want to see you naked. Turn around. There we go. How weird is that? <laughs> it makes sense because the cloak's attached to his head, but it still looks like you're shooting them naked. It's like Senran Kangura. Peach Beach Splash. Or Irrigon. The upcoming sexy VR game. RPG. Don't! No! I hate that! That came for me! That was a homing missile! Uh, he's definitely dead, right? Yeah. That's not good. Oh, I'm nearly at max health! Right, I need to snipe them. I need to Wesley snipe them. Come on, Wesley. Let's do this. Wesley snipes time. Right, where are they? There's one. Dead. Dead. Yeah, and one more. Put that boulder on there. Dead. And the world was a safe place once more. Na, 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 na. Oh, hello. Who's come in? I heard the door open. There's clearly someone in it now. Hello? Hello? I swear I heard someone come in. Oh! Oh! No! Stop that! Stop it. Dead, thank you. I love that the crossbow ones go down pretty quick. Oh, hello. Oh, where is he? I can hear him, I can't see him. Oh! There he is, right through there. Look. One, two, three, four. Nice. Oi, don't come up this don't come up this ladder. Don't. No. Don't come up the ladder. I told you not to. I can do this all day, lads. I can do this all day. Whee! You survived? Actually impressed! 
Good job, man. Well done. Crap on a stick. You're pretty tough. Thanks, mate. Oh, hello. Oh. <laughs> I completely expected him to be dead before he had another chance to, uh, you know, crossbow me in the face. How foolish was I? Right, we good? Yeah, we good. We can leave now. Oh my lordy lord. Calm down, guys. There's a lot of you there. Doesn't help you though, does it? This is too powerful. I'm not mad about it. It's just, it's just, it's just crazy. Oh. Two, two chaps there. A uh, couple more. That one's got a rocket launcher. Bloody hell. No, we can't have that rocket launcher one. Oh, God. Kick them. Piss. No, I'm not fond of this. Whoa! No! Alright. This time. This time. Undoubtedly time. Whoa! Two for one! I should get a prize for that. No, put it down. Flipping rocket launcher boy. Oh, it's just me and you now. Chop you to bits. Chop you to bits. Oh my god, cut you to ribbons. Stay dead. Ch come on. Come, come on. I'll just keep doing this. Dick. Well, that was a bit intense, wasn't it? Got an itchy nose. Not due to the intensity. I don't think uh, that's how itches work. Oh my lord, what is this room? Okay. Right, well let's... Ah, reload. Well, if they're just going to stand there, they're not going to come for me. I'll shoot their stupid heads off. He's not dead. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Ooh! Mate. Get dead. Who are these guys? Go there. Go to the bell. Go to the bell. Go to the bell. Go to the bell. Someone behind me. Oh my god, there are. Jesus! Jesus! No! This ain't good. Grenades? No grenades. Oh, he's chasing me. <laughs> right, he's dead. Good. Right, are we good? We've got ammo in here? Don't... Oh, have we? Three bullets in there, yeah. Right, okay. Go to the bell. Turn around again. Oh, he didn't turn around again. Go that way. He's off, he's off. He's doing his thing. Nice! Yes! Smash them to bits. Oh, look at that. Oh, it's gone. You can do a cool, like, roly poly throw. Like, you go side. Whoa! That's some John Wick shit. Although, actually, he doesn't do any, like, flamboyant stuff, does he? He just shoots. Shoots and kills. He aims for their head and makes sure they're dead. That's his That's his motto. That's the catchphrase in those films, right? Shoot for the head, make sure they're dead. He's always saying that. This is the most fun I've had in a game this year, I think. I'm starting to think about my games of the year already, because it's, it's getting there, you know? And, um... Oh, hello. What's going on? Oh, it's the Verdugo. Leon! <laughs> Mr. Kennedy. Mr. Kennedy. Don't you know when it's time to throw in the towel? I do think this is going to be part of my uh, Game of the Year discussions for sure. Oh. Right. Where's that been the entire game? Hmm. Would have made certain scenarios so much good. easier. Beep. Hello, mate. Well, maybe you have nine lives, but it doesn't matter now. Why is that? I've sent my right oh, he's dead. To dispose of you. Your right hand comes off? <laughs> <laughs> Say whatever you please. Die, you worm! Mate, you're the one that looks like a worm. 
Alright, here we go. Up to the Verdugo fight. It's one of the coolest fights in the game, honestly. Um, it's why I wanted to capture it. It's why I was intent on going back and, and redoing the chapter because I didn't want to miss out on it. It's such a cool moment. Um, should I... Should I talk to you for... No, I'll talk to you. Yeah, I'll talk to you. Okay. Verdugo fight. And one of the reasons I wanted to capture this is because there's only one instance of this bit. <laughs> that was just the door closing? That's fine. It's fine. We, we, yeah, it's fine. Okay. Now, most people agree... Beep. It's not responding. Power must be out. Uh, most people agree this is the right time to use the free rocket launcher you get if you pick it up. Because this thing can take a lot of beating. But the rocket launcher will put it down immediately. You cheeky scorpion bastard. Right, we're going. We're going, we're going, we're going, we're going. Stop it. Stop it. Oh, it's coming from below. Piss off. I hate him. I hate him so much, but I love him at the same time. Jesus Christ! Calm down! It's like a xenomorph! Xenomorph! I'll tip that over in a minute. Right, you have to freeze this thing with liquid nitrogen. Right, inventory's full. That's fine. Power's coming on, baby. And then I'm locked in with it. Oh, it's gonna be fine. Survive for four minutes. We don't need to. I'm gonna equip my <laughs> rocket launcher now. And hopefully, this is going to go nice and smoothly. In theory. Alright. Beep. That didn't work. Beep. That worked. <gasps> Honestly, if that's not a xenomorph, I don't know what it is. It just doesn't... It's, got, it's like a xenomorph with a predator's face. <gasps> oh my god, what's that? He hit me. He hit me big. Right. Hopefully that gets him. Where is he? No. No. No! Oh, it got him! Thank God for that! Right, check this out. Come here. Come here! Die, you piece of shit. And that is what the free rocket launcher's for. <laughs> oh, it's so good. And it drops a really valuable little piece that can be attached to something else later. Ah, Verdugo. What a rubbish, well, awesome enemy, and you can make that encounter really intense if you, um, if you long it out and you try and survive the four minutes dodging it and stuff and fighting it, and yeah, or you can just blow up with this. Now, one thing to know about the rocket launcher is I've spent the entire game holding my guns with my right hand and firing them with that trigger. The rocket launcher, because the trigger is here on the left, it, it, confused me the first time I did it, when, when my recording broke, because I was sitting there going, oh my god, it doesn't work, it doesn't work, clicking the right trigger. And of course it wasn't going to work, because that's not where the, the actual trigger for the rocket launcher is, it's there, on the left hand, so you have to press the opposite. So smart, so, so smart. Ah, right, we're up to new stuff again now. Ooh, villagers! I haven't seen you guys for a while, nice to see you. Not when you do that, it's not. I don't want worm heads, thank you very much. Get out of here. Stop that. Put that worm away. Put your worm away, young man. Thank you. If you don't put it away, I'll put it away for you. Oh, it's a bit spooky and dark in here. Where's that torch that Ashley had? Can we use that? Uh, okay. Minecart. That's nice. It's not going to fall on me, is it? It looks like it's going to bloody fall on my head. Swinging lighting. Appreciate that. Again, attention to detail. I love it. Ooh, lots of fellas. Hello, guys. What have you got out? You've not got dynamite, have you? No, you've got an axe. It's fine. Wee, don't throw that at me, you shit. You come up the ladder. Don't come up the ladder. Exactly. I can stay up here all day, guys. Like, I've got... Whoa. Got you under control. There we go. There we go. You can try it again, are you? Alright, come on in. Come on. Come on. Oh! 
missed the first one, but I got you with the second, didn't I? Oh, bugger! Right, let's deal with this nice and quick, shall we? It's another gun that's massively upgraded due to the fact you can just one-hand it. <laughs> it becomes incredibly overpowered. Oh, put that down, son. I want them. Yeah, it becomes incredibly overpowered. I say, much like the rifle. Just one-handing these guns, just it's just crazy. What was that? Oh, hello. Idiot. He took that like a champion, though. Fair play. Fair bloody play, mate. I'm not even scared of you at this point. Have you seen this? Have you seen this hand cannon that I now have? I am not fussed about your stupid chainsaw ways. Yeah, I know. Yeah. 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 Oh. oh. How do I load it? In there. Okay. Oh, God. This is all going a bit wrong. I'm getting a bit too cocky. That's better. That's better. Stay down. Flipping hell. We done? Finished? Thank you. Ooh, a nice big bundle of dynamite. No way of lighting it though, I don't have a lighter. I assume I don't have a lighter, I haven't seen one in the whole game, so... This boulder is blocking the path, yeah. Ah, there we go. Uh... <laughs> Someone had a lighter. God, that's convenient. It just blew up that exact bit of boulder and not the path that I need to walk across to get over there. Absolute magic. Absolute magic. Alright. Making great time, I feel like. Oh! This looks cool. This looks very cool. Oh, I think this is... I think this is the room you fight two El Gigante at the same time? Oh, if I was ever going to use my TMP, it's now. Not very high damage, but it does... Puts out a lot of bullets, you know? Ugh. I think this is the room. What's that there as well? More health. Incredible. Look at that, there's a little thing up there. I can ride that. Whee! Over there, for some reason, probably. I kind of want to ride that. Shall I ride that? Is it even something I can do? Slide down. Oh, I don't get to... Wasn't worth it. Wasn't worth it. It's like queuing up for something at all towers and it's just not that good when you get to the front. Oh my god, it's a bondage, El Gigante. One with some bondage on and one with a nice little mask. Right, just start unloading. Just I've got so look how cool they look. Don't do it. Right, you're going through the moon door, mate. I remember this. Moon door, moon door. He's gone! He's not! Oh my god, he's got me! Oh no! Don't squish my bones! Don't squish my bones! You dick! Your friend's melting! Join him! Join him! Oh my god, they look so good! Come on. Now do a bit of climbing. I don't know if it's worth shooting those things before climbing. Oh, I'm really not sure. TMP again. Keep going with this. Right in your face. I love they like blink and stuff. They look really good. Look at him. Shoot his knees. Oh, crap on it. Calm down, mate. You know what? You can come here as well. Come here. Come here. Come here. Hit me. I can't use it again. Bugger. It's fine. I think he's dead anyway. Come down. Enough. <sighs> that is a cool fight. That is a very cool fight. To be honest, it's probably worth killing them outside of the moon door because uh, you don't get the treasure if they're in there. Oh, I forgot about that. I love that. That's so good. I like how one of them is wearing like full bondage gear. I wonder what they were getting up to in here before they came over. Don't really want to know. It's horrible images. 
Yep, there we go. Come off the ceiling. Let's just finish him off. Oh, T and PM. Yep. T and PM? Is that it's not called that? Oh, Jesus. Slimy bug bastards. Piss off. Ah! Good God. Oh my good lord. <sighs> TMP's kind of cool for crowd control, but I feel like I could have done that a lot quicker and more efficiently with a shotgun. Come on, come on. I can shoot. Yeah, there we go. Right, that's one light on. I don't, I do not, I do not remember this at all. Take that. Don't find myself getting killed. Um, but no, I don't remember any of this. It's so strange because, as I say, I've, I've played the game so many times, but I'm, I don't play it religiously um, like every year or every couple of years, let's say. It just kind of it's when the the, the moment takes me <laughs> when I think, oh, Resident Evil Four. I haven't played that in a while, and it's obviously been a little while since I've done that. This is this is the first time playing it in years, probably now. Come on. Fall. 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 That's not a hole there. Bloody hell. Oh, God, I hate him. Christ. It's all good. Doing alright. Green eye. They've got to be worth a pretty penny, right? Fall. Stay dead. Don't get back up. It's for your own good. Ah, oh, right. Uh, is that Braille? Or oh, that's like Morse code? Interesting. Well, that's going to crush me, isn't it? All right, okay. Up, up. Through. Hoi. God. Down. Go, go. Yeah. What does that do? That stops the middle one from slamming, so I've got somewhere to sit. Yeah, okay. Up, up. Uh, good God, that was close. Scratched me nose. There we go. That's quite a few guys here, isn't it? Have some more fire. That went well. Bloody hell, you're wiggly. Wiggly worms, you just can't catch them. Wiggly worms. That was sweet. This is very sweet. Where are you going? Oh my god, these headshots. Oh, what is this power? Come on. Don't. There we go. Whoa. This is almost completely upgraded, to be fair. I think it's, what, 2.3 um, strength. Oh, hello. One more step. I think it maxes out at 2.4, 2.5. It's just so trusty. You could easily go through the entire game with just the uh, just the pistol. It's a good, it's a good challenge run, actually. Just pistol. <laughs> I have no recollection of this place. <laughs> I know there's an Unforastero. Look at all these bear traps you've set for me. How sweet of you. How sweet of you indeed. Sweet it is to be loved by you. No. I love the old one, two. One. Oh. Oh. Two. Oh. can't shut doors in this game. Once they're open, they're open. There we go. Oh, right. Get my shotgun out. Go back in. Are you loaded? Yeah, you're loaded. Right now. Hello. Who's that now? I killed everyone out there. Who are you? What the f... Stay down, mate. Ooh. 
Ooh. Whoa. No. That's another one. There's a mini one there. Are you mini? No, not very mini. Oh, this is problematic. Whoa. This is very... Are you dead yet? He is. Come on, man. Give up now. Oh, I can't flip that gun. I probably can. Just wasn't trying hard enough. Oh, where are you now? Christ! Jeez, this place is horrible. Yellow herb, give it to me. Where am I heading to right now? Just back to the castle? I don't, I don't know. Oh no, I'm going to the big, the big cylinder because that's where they took Ashley. I'm still trying to get back to Ashley, aren't I? Oh, I think this chapter ends with a, oh, with the Salazar boss fight. Look, I've done this. Oh no, not them as well. Not the dead space creatures. Oh my god, no. No dead space, no dead space, no dead space. Christ. <sighs> Those things are straight out of dead space. They look like the reanimators. That's an arena. <laughs> That's... Is it? Sure looks like an arena to me. Or is it like quicksand? Don't stand on that. That looks like that will kill me. I go here, I go here, and I should better get out here. Right? Shoot it. Shoot it! <sighs> right, where's the best place to be? No, don't get in my car! Get- No! Yeah, run over! They better not get in the back, because I'm not checking the back. <laughs> I'm staying in the middle. Middle's safe. Where, where are we going? Uh, I want to go that way. Oh, no. <laughs> Until Dawn, Rush of Blood, Resident Evil 4 edition. All right. Get on the tracks. Oh, first person makes this so much easier. Because you can see around the corners, you can see where they're coming. And you can preempt and shoot them off. Oh, still very cool. Right, staying in the middle car. Middle car is the safest car. I'm not getting hit in the head by no bits of wood. We're not doing it. Not today. Get off. No, he needs to go. Yeah. That was a silly... Uh-oh. Oh, he landed with me. That's fine, he's dead. Whoa, 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 whoa. Uh-oh. Oh, my God. Oh. Oh, good God. No, no. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. I'm not in a good place. Out of bullets. Heal. No heals. I've got to stop and heal. Sorry, guys. Ooh. Breaking the tension very, very much so. Let's do one of those. And we're back to it, thank you. Ugh. You, bugger off. <sighs> oh, didn't know you were there, sorry. Christ, that was insane. Ay, ay, ay. Very nearly died there. I don't think I've got anything for this yet. That's empty. Come on, drop me some ammo. I don't think they do. I think it falls underneath the track and rolls away. Oh, oh. Oh, no! Oh. This is so good. Stay dead. Stay dead. Thank you. No, not today. You dead? Yeah, you're dead. Thank God for that. Oh, I thought that wooden plank was going to be the end of me. I didn't... Oh. I don't like this. don't like the fact they're still there. 
Right, we're going to get rid of the wood plank. No, we're not. Yes, we are. Go back, 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 back. Both of them. Lovely. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. What is going on? <laughs> you could have shown me that in first person, surely. Right, off we go. Oh, thank God for that. Some handgun bullets. My only ones, though. I've never been that low on handgun ammo. Really troubling. Really, really troubling. Right, I need to find some. There's got to be some, some... Oh, this, this is the bit with the big moving thing! Oh, the big giant Salazar robot thing! <laughs> oh, that is so cool. It looks massive. Oh! you got to get it moving, haven't you? And it, like, smashes through the... I think. Uh, again, my memory is patchy at best. Right, okay. But we're still rocking this shotty, but I must be getting low on ammo there. Yep, here they come. Remove the bloody bridge. What a bunch. Oh my god, there's so many of them. Right, here we go. Let's do this. I'm not messing around here. We're going both guns. Didn't really know that was an option, but uh, turns out it is. And it is about as glorious as you would have thought. Don't know how I'll reload, but that's someone else's problem. Fall to your death, please. Oh, hello. That was cool. <laughs> okay, if you really start to experiment with stuff here, mm -hmm, there's some real fun to be had. No ammo. No ammo. Oh my god, you're close to me. You good? Uh oh, uh oh. Uh oh. Right, they can't come down to me, no? No, they can't. Right, let's get on that hand. Take me up to the clouds. Thank you. Oh, good God. <sighs> my health is not doing okay, and I don't have anything equipped in my health slot, so that's not good. Are right, you dead? Yeah, you're dead. Ugh! Give me back my bridge. Right, I need to put something in that health slot, otherwise I'm going to die. Okay, I think I need to pull that switch now. Look at them. Idiots. Hoi! Ugh! Yeah, there we go. Come on. Nice! Oh, look! Floating thingy-majigs. I forget what they're called. Are they maces? I don't think that's a mace. Uh, round here? Yeah, back of his head. And that makes both of them move? Yeah, lovely. Okay. You can't come in. It's not for you. Witness your friend's death. Oh, you're already dead. Right, that's my bridge built. Hello? Ooh, ooh, hello. What's that about? Good God. No ammo. Oh, this is getting rough. This is getting rough on the old ammo front. Please stay dead. Knife. Right, no shotgun bullets. Very few handgun bullets. Very few. Right, I'm not going to bother about him. I'm going to go. I'm going to go. I'm going to go. Oh, he's a coming. Big Papa's coming. Run, Leon, run. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, my gosh. Just giant quick time events. Ah, uh, triggers. Leon. Uh oh. Go through the door. <laughs> Holy flip. He's still coming. Oh my god. Okay, just... Ah! 
Get up there, you shit! Oh, you floppy-haired weirdo. Where's it gone? Did it fall into the abyss? What a waste of a giant, like, mech. God, this looks eerily reminiscent of the, like, the lobby area from the, <laughs> from the original game, from the original mansion. Very, like, reminiscent. Just the, the shape of it. And seeing it in here, like, it's the two winding, well, it's the winding staircase, and that, like, it just, yeah, you can really tell it's a Resident Evil project. Right, okay. Let's chase him down. Okay, I'm starting to remember all this now. It's all coming back to me. Oh, bugger. That's not good, is it? Uh, where's that going to go? Where's that going to stop? It's like Donkey Kong. Going to keep coming? No, it stops there. Thank God for that. All right. Right, right so they break there. Oh, God. Can I shoot them? Yeah, I can. Alright, if I go up there, I can stop the dickhead that's shooting him down. Flipping hell, that's a lot of guys. I'm going to have to use grenades here. Yeah, it's going to have to be grenades. Or I can use this to send them down to kill them. Keep sending them down. I actually need to go down there, really, to get some of that ammo. Yeah, I'm going to nip down. Nip down for the ammo. Right, there's a couple coming. Right. Knife him. Yes, come on. Hell yeah. I need all the ammo I can get. Let's not worry about that one, though. Ah, up the tower. It's going to come down to grenades, though. It's all going to come down to grenades. It's not going up. Maybe it's overload capacity. Oh, yeah. Get off. Get off. You're weighing me down. Nope. Oh, good God. Where, 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 where? Hello, lads. Oh, good God. Nope, not worrying about that then. There we go. Ah, shotgun bullets. Did they all go? Fantastic. Hey guys. Hello. Oh no. That's gonna suck. Get off. God, this sucks. He's still in. Come on. Expertly done. Well, I'm just running out of ammo even more. We done? Can I not jump that gap? There's goodies over there. I think we'll go all the way around. <sighs> right. Alright, I have equipped the broken butterfly. I uh, don't know how many bullets I've got, but I think this is now a boss fight, and this is surely the best time to use it, right? Otherwise, I won't use it. Oh, I remember this! Big, horrible anus. Ah, you just missed her. The ritual <laughs> is over. She left with my men to an island. What? Off they go to the island. Bye, Ashley. I will come and save you. Don't worry. I think it's time I paid my due respects towards your impressive and stubborn will. Come on, then. I dare you. Mr. Ken. Oh my god, he's going to become a giant squid monster. Well, at least he's going in as well. Thank god for that. Whee! <laughs> Couple of rounds to the face. 
won't last long. There's the eyeball. <laughs> Always an eyeball, isn't it? How many shots is it going to take? One. And now he's exposed himself. Bosh. Oh, good God. Just keep shooting him. Three. Four. Five. One in the eye. Uh oh. Do I need to reload? That's cool. Oh, God. He's quite tough, isn't he? Whoa! Come on, eyeball pull. Easy peasy, easy peasy. Just use your magnum and kill him to death. I threw it too far, that would have been a really cool thing if I caught it, but you know I'm not cool, so it's fine. See you later, Castle. You've been fun. You've been, you've been really fun, actually. Really good part of the game. Ah, <sighs> but all good things must... Oh, no! You stupid snakes! All good things must come to an end. Beep. Ada? There she is. Oh. Effortlessly cool. You, ride, handsome? <laughs> you know I do. Okay. Ah, and that brings us to the end of chapter four. I am kind of bummed I couldn't get this out uh, in line with my other uploads. I wanted to do it one a day until the end, but the recording issues with the quest put me back by a day. But it's fine. We're back on track now. One more part, I'll upload chapter five, including the last boss of the game, hopefully Monday night, unless anything else goes wrong, so watch this space. And then it'll be back to regular uploads. Got a lot of great stuff coming in November. I can't wait to show you what we're cooking up. Loads of great VR games to look at. But for now, thank you for watching. Please leave a like, leave a comment, and hit subscribe, and I'll see you tomorrow for the conclusion to Resident Evil 4 in VR. Take care of yourselves. See you later, guys.